welcome back to a simply simple life thank you guys for visiting me here today i got my eyelashes done so over at sephora you can purchase their eyelashes and then they um they put it um on for you um as a complimentary um service so that was really nice of them and then i also bought a couple of stuff so maybe i'll do a haul of uh what i got over in sephora on my next video but uh, all right Anyways, today I'm super excited. Um, <laughs> I wanted to share an unboxing with you guys. I was supposed to do an unboxing of my last purse. I think this was like back in February. This is the Speedy uh, Louis Vuitton 35. I believe this is the 35 size. Um, I'm not really into too much of these um, luxury handbags. I just have a couple. This was my second, my second one. The first one I had was the um, the monogram graceful. I love, 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 love that bag. It's a very nice um, feminine bag for me. Really enjoy the print on that one, but I have to be very delicate um, when it's raining over here in the Pacific Northwest. But with this one, I feel like this one really holds its um, its uh, quality where I don't have to worry so much if it gets a little bit of uh, rain on it because we do get a lot of drizzle throughout the year over here in Seattle. So I have been enjoying this <laughs> very much, but um, for Christmas, I did purchase myself. Well, I let hubby purchase it, but it has been my saving. So um, some of you um, have asked me for quite some time like what I do. So <laughs> I do YouTube. I've always, I've always done multiple jobs and I think um, it's really nice for us women, especially stay at home moms, to have a little bit of income here and there. I used to have a little bit of income, like five different little bits of income here and there and it would help out with like utilities or with food or things, um, activities for the kids because I have four children. One is um, attending University of uh, Washington. One is a senior that um, got accepted to University of, uh, I'm sorry, Central Washington State University. And then I have a middle schooler and then I have a preschooler. And believe me, my preschooler, her tuition is like sending my son to college, okay? so. I do, and then plus they do hula, they do Tahitian, they do volleyball, they do orchestra. Um, and then the other one is in cheer, so there's a lot of fundraising. So a lot of our, my, a lot of the income gets distributed to the kids and plus, you know, the home. Um, but I, I always had these little side, side gigs to be able to, to put a little bit of money in there just for me. <laughs> just for me so this one I actually saved for me and it took me about maybe eight months eight months to, to really save that in my full-time job I do get bonuses every two months I get a bonus every year and then I have YouTube and then I have Sensi you guys know I love my Sensi so I'm a Sensi addict myself so I have another video here that I'm gonna share to be able to um, to unbox with you guys but this is hard earned money and i think it's nice for us to be able especially women especially when we have kids that we tend to forget ourselves and i've been trying to to just put aside something just for myself so that what well, yes it does make me happy i'm not gonna <laughs> i'm not gonna go sugarcoat it but yes it does make me happy to be able to put something aside just for me and then when i'm ready to make a purchase for whatever it is whatever makes your heart happy purchase it for yourself you know and you deserve it maybe the clothes maybe makeup uh, maybe going on vacation by yourself with your best friend or with your hubby or with your boyfriend doesn't matter what it is just make you put something aside for yourself that you feel like you deserve later on that you can indulge in whatever it may be okay so with that being said i got a new baby okay this is like the baby baby this is the queen of my bags um i <laughs> i told hubby she's the queen all right so it finally got me the queen i've been wanting her for so long and and we have a uh we have a louis vuitton store here over in bellevue we also have one in downtown seattle but i'm so surprised that it's inside a nordstrom so it doesn't have that big of a uh I, don't, I feel like it doesn't have that big of a selection. That's where I got my graceful from was in downtown Seattle. I didn't feel the, 
the um like the one-on-one -on -one to be able to you know try out other purses so i wanted to make sure that um i got this one over in bellevue speedy i got over in bellevue as well but it comes in this for the holiday i don't know if it's just for the holiday but it comes in this really nice um retro uh retro bag i thought that was pretty cool and i'm gonna stand up for this video i'm sorry i over here in Pacific Northwest, our weather is just gloomy the whole day. So I was trying to find a way to be able to show you guys of a better lighting, but it is what it is. Hey, there you go. This I hope that's better. Okay, more brighter. Okay, so when you purchase something from Louis Vuitton, it does come into this nice uh, purchase envelope. And then it has your receipt. And then it has, um, like, I, I keep the, the tags into there into the envelope and then thank you for shopping kind of card and then um lv and then the receipt okay i was going to portland to be able to purchase this so that i don't have to pay uh tax but all right so it comes into the nice um box that louis vuitton is known for Oh my gosh i love the box i love this one better than the other ones that it came in because i feel like this one i can actually store a bag in there um my sales associate david who is really really helpful he um okay so i went in there for a favorite and he's like you don't want it and i'm like yes david i want a favorite so what he did was he um he took my order for a um pochette matisse um the monogram the canvas monogram i went home and i just i couldn't sleep i was i was a i was a wreck um it's a beautiful bag i feel but i'm just not i don't think i'm just ready for that yet um i really want the favorite and so seeing this we were we purchased it already he was you know taking care of you know the boxing and putting in a bag and then i'm like david what is that behind you it was a um, it was a favorite, but it was in the smaller size. And he goes, no, you don't want that. And then I tried it on. It was kind of small because the favorite is just a very, you know, small purse that you know, crossbody. He's like, you don't want that. He goes, I go, don't worry. I'm still going to get this, but I really want this. He's like, okay, I'm going to put your name on. Um, I'm going to put you on a list to for the um, if you really like the, the print that you have for the Speedy for a favorite but the mm size not the other one so i'm hoping that it will come in okay but anyways for this one i'm sorry friends i'm so excited okay it's magnetic at the front and all right let me just put this aside oh look i can use it as a table okay i'm so excited I got the artsy, uh, is it the Noor? The black leather. And I think she's beautiful. He only had two um, in the store. So he made, <laughs> he made me go through them to make sure um, it is which one I wanted. This one was actually on display. And there was something about me that was like, oh, I don't want the one in display because I don't know how long it's been dusted up there because it was high up. And I don't know how many people, I mean, for the price. This is a pretty pricey bag for me because I'm not I'm not much of a collector, even though I, I you know I have three, but I, I want I just want to be able to have one, um, two more after this one. I really want the Neverfull. I was kind of debating between this one and the Neverfull, and the reason that I got to this one is hubby's like okay, this is your ultimate bag, right? Like this is the the most priciest bag that you want. I said yes. I go, I go, that's, that's like the queen of bags for me. He's like, okay, well, you deserve it. You earn it. You have enough. You save enough to be able to get that. So just get it. And so I'm like, okay. <laughs> but I still want the, um, the never full. And I'm debating. I don't know if I want the MM or the GM, but I definitely want it into the canvas uh, monogram. So that's going to be my next purchase if my favorite never comes in before then. Okay. But back to the artsy. Out of all the um, the different canvases and this one, I opt for this one because I'm just for me. I'm I'm a black. I like to wear black. I like. I just think that with black, I don't have to think so much. Okay, and I'm not too fashionable. I I don't. 
I don't dress up too nicely. I just want this because it calls me, okay? Um, the other thing that, the, the thing that gravitates me to this is how big it is, how bulky it is. So when I tried this on, um, I did watch a couple of videos just to see how comfortable they are uh, with, the, with the owners that has these, how they like it. A lot of them say that they don't like it so much because it's just very heavy. It is heavy in itself, just holding it with nothing in here. The only thing in here is uh, David added some, um, these bubble thingies for me. And he said that um, if you, you go with Diane, if you get packages from um, Amazon, um, always save these because these are like the best ones to really hold the shape of the bag. Don't ever put it into the original um, box because it's just going to um, ruin the bag. So that was really nice. Okay, so he got me a couple of them. Now there's nothing in here. The inside, I don't know if you guys can see it because of the lighting. The inside is gray, like like gray and black stripe. And it has three pockets on this one. Um, it says Louis Vuitton Paris as the tag. And then this one has three pockets as well on this side with a zipper. And then, oh, oh. And then um, for this one, I got the little monogram so I did tell him to put the um, the name of it onto that receipt when we were looking through the bag because I that's where I would like to keep it so I'm just gonna keep it in that um, envelope as well but it comes with a zipper it's a nice uh, zipper that you can um, put your wallet in there so you're not constantly reaching I feel that oh and then it has a little key the keyhole in here and then it has another tag but I cannot read it um, uh, I think this is where it says the made in. So I think this is made in U.S. Yep, yeah. yeah, made in USA. Okay, so my bag is made in USA. Um, I love it. <laughs> I love it. I love that everything in here is black and then it has the gold, um, uh, gold hardware. Um, it has the four, like, grommets. Um, two on each side. The handle is very, very, very sturdy, very nice and thick that I feel like it's going to really hold the bag of the weight of the bag, um, plus these grommets. The thing with the Neverfull that I was kind of, I really want the Neverfull, even though everybody has the Neverfull. This is why also Hubby says, grab this one because this is your, your queen bag, as you say it, grab, get it. But the other thing, and he said, is like everybody has the never fall. Every woman I see has that, you know, that tote bag. So like I said, I still want it because I think it's a, it's a, because I'm used to tote. That, that's, um, before this one, I had many coach bags and then um, Michael Kors. And I've always used the totes for photography when I was still doing photography. So I, I'm very accustomed to like the tote feel of a bag. But um, the thing with the Neverfull is the thin strap. I just don't know with all the things that's gonna fit in there how, I'm very uncomfortable no matter what kind of bag it is that with the, with the strap. So I kind of tend to hold it here anyways. And then with this one, um, I'm five, five, five almost. <laughs> but I will hold it like this. But when I tried it at the store, it does kind of reach up high here to where I feel like it's uncomfortable, but it's not, and it's, it's thick. So you're kind of going like this and I'm going on my tiptoes, but I like how big it is. That's the thing that sold me to this bag is that the, the thickness of it and the black, all black, um, leather material. Okay. So that's the, that's the, one of the things that, I knew going into purchasing the bag, even though it's it's a pretty pricey bag, that it, I may not like it because of it's very low right here. It, there's not enough space for the shoulder, but I also like how it goes like this. And I'm used to carrying a, a purse like this because of the Speedy. So with the Speedy 35, um, if you compare, 
And then with this Speedy 35, this is just how I carry it, okay? And I'm used to that. So I think because I'm so used to the Speedy 35 like this, I don't mind carrying this like this, okay? And if I need to, I will go like this, okay? It has the brass, I'm um, sorry, it has the um, hardware at the bottom so that you don't get the leather um, dirty or scraped and, yeah. Okay. And then I love how this looks where it's creased um, over. It just puts a lot of dimension on the purse and I think it just adds a, a lot of a uh, touch to it when it crease like that rather than just one piece. Okay. And then there's the there's the leather. Okay. And then it comes with this. I want um, for Christmas from the kids, I told the girls that I want those um, poof poof chains in here and um i think it's a black and black and white one mixed together so i'm just going to add that in here um if they happen to purchase it for me for um for christmas and i think it's just through etsy danielle found one so i really like that one it's very nice i love the inside if you guys can see the the other thing that may not sell with this bag is that it's hard to get into i can it's very deep but unlike the Neverfull, it's not white to where you can easily reach into it. Um, it just has a, a very, um, not, not a wide opening like the Neverfull. And I like that because then no one can easily see what's inside. And then how it, it's like, there's no magnet with this, um, like the, the Graceful that I have. But because of the material, it just automatically kind of, binds um, like connects together okay I love it okay and then here's the the key oh. okay nice and long and thin so you can still add a little um, thing in here which actually he gave me a black a luggage tag and then he um, heat stamped my initials in there that we can pick up anytime he said it, about four days um, but the thing is with that one it's silver he said all the black ones has that silver um, hardware to it so I think that's fine with it because then I'm gonna add it in here and then I'm gonna add the poof so it's going to be like maybe underneath and that's okay um, it was free he gave it to me for free he said normally it was like $60 but this one is also a key. You can um, attach your key in here if you had wanted to, but I actually like it just plain like that, okay? Again, the artsy nor, and they said that, um, some of the videos I watched said that there, this is actually like, like a very dark, dark blue. It's not, it's just black. And I did ask um, David about that over at the Louis Vuitton store. He, he showed me the one that's more of a blue and you can see the difference. This is just, this is black, um, black in color. I love her. She's super, super beautiful. The artsy. And that's it, friends. I just wanted to share that with you guys. I do have another unboxing of a Louis Vuitton. It's something for hubby. I purchased him a little uh, something just to just to have his little collection started as well. He deserves it as well because when I'm working hard, he's working um, as hard as well. You know, watching the kids, taking over the kids' um, duties when I I'm not. So that's. Um, that's my relationship with my husband is that we we work together as a team um and we just spend our you know our, our time with our kids or busy at work or busy with the home so much things that needs to be done with the home as far as um um adding on to it or just uh, making it almost into our forever home so <laughs> we don't think that we're gonna stay here forever forever but you know we might as well just really enjoy it and uh, make the best out of it while we are here so all right friends i hope you guys enjoyed this video 
and one last time I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys close up of the bag she's beautiful she's gorgeous I even though I feel like one it's heavy to um, right here it's just uh, doesn't have that much space I still love it uh, I was walking around the store with it trying to make sure that it's something that I truly would want so as you guys can see far away this is how she looks like and like I said, I wear a lot of black. That's why I chose this, um, the black leather so that I don't have any um, transfer color um, on with my black um, outfit and dark colored outfits. So that's how I'm gonna wear her. All right, friends, thank you guys for visiting A Simply Simple Life. Mahalo.